Do you get this error message? NVIDIA control panel access denied. Failed to apply the selected settings to your system. If you have this problem, this is the video to help you solve the problem. What we first can try is to run the NVIDIA control panel as an administrator. To do this, you go to this PC, local disk C, program files, NVIDIA corporation and control panel client. Inside this little folder, you find this nvcplui.exe. This is the NVIDIA control panel. Right click it and set run as an administrator. Then you can try to apply the settings and see if you get the error message. If this worked, what you can do is you can right click and then you can send it to desktop. On the shortcut, you right click, you select properties, advanced, check run as an administrator, OK, apply, OK. Now running that control panel will indeed make it work just fine. However, if it doesn't work, the most usual fix is to update the drivers. We'll need to update them manually, so we need to download the drivers from NVIDIA's homepage and install them manually and not via GeForce Experience this time. And make sure you select the game ready drivers. Click Windows key X and choose Device Manager. Click Device Manager. Inside the device manager, you can see under display adapters, you can see what kind of NVIDIA card you have. Note that number down very carefully so you can see exactly which card you have. Then you go to the NVIDIA homepage, link in description, and choose that exact card as you had in your device manager. And it's important it's the same, like I had the 950M, that's the laptop version. So make sure it's the right version. Windows 10 is my system. Then there are game ready drivers and studio drivers. Um, basically everyone should just go with game ready drivers. Then you just click search. And then you go to the download page and you just click download. Save it wherever you like. Then you can just launch the exe file directly from the browser, or you can just search up where you have chosen to save it. And then you just double click on it. And of course, agree to the UAC if it asks you, and then also click OK on the extraction process. When the extraction is done, it will launch the installation process. Here, it will check your system's compatibility. If you selected the wrong drivers, it will tell you here. Then you can see we have GeForce Experience and only the graphics drivers. Select only the graphics drivers. You can use GeForce, uh, GeForce Experience if you want to, but I don't really particularly like it. And it draws down your performance on your system a little bit. On Express or Customized, you choose the Customized install below. Check that box and click Next. Here we can see we have checked physics and the graphics drivers, but not the NVIDIA GeForce experience. We have something called a clean installation. This will remove some different settings you have set before. And this is a very good idea to check if you have any kind of graphics driver issues. If you don't have any issues, you don't need to check it. Then you just wait for the installation process to finish. It may take several minutes. Installation was completed and successful. You can now close down this window. Now you should have the latest NVIDIA drivers on your system for your graphics card. I hope this video helped you solve the issues with your NVIDIA control panel access denied error. If it did, please leave a like and see you in future videos. Check the description and playlist for other useful videos that might help you. Thanks for watching. Jumadesen, signing out.